thank you all for joining us today. I'm Patricia Vance. I'm president of the Entertainment Software Rating Board. Uh, it's a pleasure to be here today to launch a new public service campaign that will educate the parents and families throughout the San Francisco Bay Area about the importance of ESRB ratings when choosing a video game for their children. We're delighted to have the invaluable support of the San Francisco Giants, especially the players who graciously lent their time to be involved in this campaign, Ryan Bolasong and Buster Posey. And as parents of young children, I know they speak from experience when they talk about how helpful the game ratings are. And so I'm very excited that both Ryan and Buster are able to join us today to help unveil the campaign, and you'll hear from them in just a moment. So just like movies, TV and music, video games have become an integral part of our culture and a widely accepted entertainment experience. Uh, but just like their entertainment counterparts, not all games are intended for kids. And that's at the core of our mission. So the ESRB plays a very important role in helping parents make informed choices for their family, and frankly, it couldn't be easier. So ESRB ratings appear on every box. On the front, there's an age rating, which will give you an idea of the age appropriateness of the game. And then when you flip the box over, next to the age rating, there are content descriptors, which will give you an idea of the nature of the content in the game, uh, what may have triggered a particular rating category assignment. Uh, we also offer a supplementary source of information for parents about the content in the game uh, called rating summaries. Uh, these are typically a paragraph or two, uh, giving a lot more information, a lot more detail about what's in the game, exactly the kind of details that we know parents want to know about. Uh, and these rating summaries are available on our website at esrb.org and also on a free mobile app. Um, Parents are involved in game purchases nearly nine times out of ten, and that's why it's so important to make sure they're informed about all of the resources that are at their disposal. And although current awareness and use of ESRB ratings are relatively high, there's always more that can and should be done. And then the ad you'll be seeing in a moment uh, really drives the message home to parents that ESRB ratings provide the guidance they need when it comes to choosing games for their kids. And now I'd, I invite, I'd like to invite Mario Aliado from the San Francisco Giants to say a few words. Great, thank you. First of all, the Entertainment uh, Software Rating Board is a new partner of the Giants this year, and uh, we're pleased that you're here, and uh, also pleased that Ryan and Buster joined us this morning. Uh, the partnership with ESRB is really a nice complement to our uh, ongoing partnership with Sony PlayStation. And I know Jack Trenton is here today, so welcome uh, to you as well. We've been together with Sony for, uh, for many years. This is really an educational partnership. Uh, we're working together to ensure that families can make decisions that are right for them when it comes to selecting their video game entertainment. And those of us with uh, children, and I have four of them, we know how important uh, th this really is. We work hard to make AT&T Park a family environment and, uh, and a safe place for families. So uh, it's, uh, it's fitting that uh, uh, that we can work together in our venue to uh, to get this message out to all of our fans. The uh, first, we had a very late game last night, so I think all of us are pleased that uh, Ryan and Buster are able to, uh, to uh, spend a few minutes with us this morning or some time with us. Uh, so thank you, and I'd like to invite uh, Buster Posey and one of us on to uh, to the podium. They're the guys in the uniform, so it's like more fun to so hear from them. Buster and Ryan. Good morning. Uh, it's a pleasure to be here on behalf of ESRB. And, oh, thanks, buddy. Um, this is such a, an important thing for, for parents and, and everyone to, to understand about the ratings on this game. And um, you just want me to handle everything so you can get your <laughs> Alright, he's got a plan tonight, I don't, so I'm going to just handle this for him too. Uh, but we, we both kind of feel the same way uh, as, as uh, young parents. We both have small children and um, we just feel that it's very important for, for parents to know what kind of games uh, their kids are playing and not every game is appropriate for every child. Um, hence the, the ratings on the, on the cover and on the back to, to tell you what's in the game. Um, 
We uh, know how sneaky kids can be and try and pull a fast one on you sometimes, so it's, uh, it's right there for you. But um, the, the one thing I learned about uh, during this uh, PSA was um, just how easy it is to obtain the information that you need, not only on the cover, but with, uh, with the app that you can use on your iPhone and, and the website. Um, it's actually uh, not, not difficult at all, even if you're not a computer person or a tech person, to, to find out the information that you need about the game. So um, it's just, it was a great, great experience for both of us. We had a lot of fun doing it. Uh, gave us a little break from, from the daily grind of spring training to, to do this, and uh, we both had a good time. And I hope uh, the message gets through the way we needed to get through. Thanks. All right, I think uh, Ryan covered most of it, but uh, to me, the, the main thing that, that I found while doing this was, was just the simplicity and the, how easy it is to see if a game is age appropriate for your child. Um, you know, as, as prevalent as video games are today, there's a lot out there, and, um, you know, not all of them are going to be appropriate for an eight, nine, ten year old. So it's, it's uh, you know, like Ryan said, we're really excited to do this, knowing that it was for a good cause to partner up with uh, ESRB. And, um, yeah, I mean, it's really just a matter of taking a, a couple of seconds. Um, if you want more information, you can use the mobile app, and uh, the information is there. So it's just a matter of, of taking time and putting some effort forward. Thank you. Thank you so much, both of you. Um, I'm going to lower the mic again. <laughs> um, so at the Epic, um, um, okay, so here we go. Um, I think at this point, uh, I think we're just going to actually introduce the PSA. So um, thank you again, Ryan and Buster, and uh, We'd like to debut the PSA now, so I guess we're on the tape. Hey guys, can I get back? Here you go, kid. Hey, don't you? Yep, vocal song and posing. Did you check the rating? The rating? Yeah, it's simple. Always check the rating symbol on the front and read the content scripture on the back. And if you need more information, you can look up rating coverage right from your phone. Thanks, guys. Uh, son, I don't think this game's for us. Maybe you should get this one. This kid can play. For more information, go to ESRB.org. Okay, here we go. <laughs> so these ads will be appearing on TV uh, stations around the San Francisco Bay Area and Northern California. We also have radio spots. Uh, we have these lovely brochures. Uh, with Buster and Ryan on the front. Uh, these are being distributed to GameStop uh, retail outlets across the area as well as other retail retailers, Bay Area retailers. Um, these are available for parents should they want them at the store. They explain the rating system inside. Um, so they're very handy little guides. Um, we also will be running uh, spots in the stadium right here at AT&T Park at Giants Home Games. So we're very excited about that. Um, we'll be able to, actually, we're happy to answer a couple of questions, um, um, and then after that, we have a very special treat for the Junior Giants today, uh, thanks to Sony. Uh, they've generously uh, provided copies of their, uh, uh, their new baseball game, the MLB 12, the show, along with a Sony PlayStation Vita for each of you who are here today. <laughs> Home as a special gift, and you'll also get a chance to play with Buster and Ryan after we finish the remarks. So, um, anyway, I'm, I'm happy to answer any questions, uh, and then we can wrap up. Any questions about the campaign? No? Okay, I guess not. So, again, Thanks everybody uh, for joining us today and special thanks 
Uh, to ESA, to Sony, to Mario, to Buster, to Ryan, uh, I'd like to specifically recognize Mike Gallagher, who's the president of the Entertainment Software Association. Uh, ESA represents the video game industry and works tirelessly to educate the public and elected officials.